Hello everyone, welcome to BanjoExpert.com. This is Ryan Christ, and today we're going to cover the forward roll, backward roll, and alternating roll. And we're also going to go over the C, G, D, and F chord in this lesson. Okay, here we go. We're going to start with the uh, beginning with the forward roll. So you'll watch the right hand. We're going to do a forward roll starting with your index finger. So it goes index, middle, thumb, index, middle, thumb. It goes third string, first string, fifth string. Third string, first string, fifth string. And you just continue to do this over and over. And then you work up your speed. Until you can play it up to a... Uh, speed the speed that you're wanting. And then you also, after you've uh, mastered the kind of 3 1 5, then you can go to 2 1 5. After you've done that a little bit, then you can go 3 2 1. So those are pretty much the three basic forward rolls. And uh, then we also have a backward roll, uh, which we'll go over right now. Backward would be one, two, three. First string, second string, and third string. And you just continue that over and over. And your, your, tr your goal is not to move your fingers any more than you have to. You don't want them to fly clear up. You just want them to stay real close to the string. Then you can go one, three, five. And you can go one, two, five. And that would be the basic, uh, three basic backward rolls. Now the last roll that we're going to go over is the alternating roll, and here's how it sounds. All you're doing is you're alternating your thumb from the third string to the fourth string, third string to the fourth string, and it's also picking uh, the fifth string uh, on the off beats. So a slow pattern would be this. Three, two, five, one. And then you do four, two, five, one. Four, two, five, one. Then you repeat that whole sequence over again. Three, two, five, one. Four, two, five, one. And you just continue that pattern over and over. speed it sounds like this so those are the three basic patterns that you will use uh, in playing the banjo you have the forward roll you have the backward roll and you have the alternating roll So that's all for the right hand. Now we're going to go over a few chords uh, on the left hand. Opens, an open strum is a G chord. You're, you're not fretting anything, it's open. Now if you fret um, index finger, first fret, second string, uh, ring, finger, ring finger, second fret, first string, and middle finger, second fret, fourth string, that is a C chord. It sounds like that. Also, barring at the fifth fret is a C chord. So those two are C's. Open is G. Uh, now, if you basically move this C chord up two frets, it's a D. But you're going to have to add the second fret on the third string. So in order to do that, you have to switch your fingers to look like this. So you have index, 
second fret third string, middle finger third fret second string, pinky finger fourth fret first string, and ring finger fourth fret on the fourth string. That's a D chord. Some little things that you can play in the D position. Kind of, can kind of do the foggy mountain hammer there. Now, also, I'll show you the F chord. The F chord is down here, what I, near what I call the third fret, because I'm fretting pinky and ring finger at the third fret. And then I have middle finger, second fret, third string. Index finger, first fret on second string. And that is the F chord. Now you move that up two frets, that's a G chord. So those are some uh, chords that you can go over, real simple chords that we use a lot in bluegrass. Uh, and we'll go over some more in the next lesson. But thanks very much. Hope you enjoyed the lesson. We'll see you next time. Bye bye.